Hello, Palm Beach County, and thanks for joining me for this weekly update. As part of the district's ongoing celebration of Hispanic Heritage Month, I'm here today at Oak Hill Middle School, which many years ago became the first International Spanish Academy in North America. And as you can see, years later, it's going stronger than ever. This International Spanish Academy is one of five in the district. The academies have been established through a partnership with the Ministry of Education and Vocational Training of Spain to provide a fully immersive Spanish to English program that enriches the students' bilingualism and their biliteracy and their appreciation of Hispanic cultures around the world. Oak Healy Middle School is the only school in Palm Beach County that offers an AP course at the middle school level, allowing students to earn a college credit in eighth grade. The district is also standing out nationally because of our innovative digital inclusion initiative. You may recall that one of the instructional challenges identified early on in the pandemic was ensuring that all students had equal access to devices and Wi-Fi. The district achieved a one-to-one -one ratio of students and devices last year, and now we continue to make great inroads in providing free high-speed internet to families that need it. The Municipal Wi-Fi Mesh Network, which is being created in collaboration with Palm Beach County, local municipalities, and business partners, is currently focused in a number of communities, including downtown Belle Glade, South Bay, Pahokee, Lake Worth Beach, Lantana, and Canal Point. The network is not 5G technology. It's a simple radio that connects broadband service to residences using Wi-Fi extenders. All the equipment utilized for this project complies with FCC guidelines. Once completed, the Municipal Wi-Fi Mesh Network will provide approximately 25,000 students with a strong, fast, free, reliable Wi-Fi connection, enabling them to access educational resources and other learning opportunities. Technology is also thriving in our classrooms. The Education Foundation, in collaboration with generous business partners, just awarded more than $175,000 to innovative teachers to further enable them to engage children, ignite their interest in areas such as college preparedness, STEM, financial literacy, and much more. Supporting students and staff through these grants is a priceless investment in the future workforce here in Palm Beach County. Also, as promised, I am continually evaluating the need for facial coverings inside our schools. As part of that, we are closely monitoring health conditions and actively working with local medical health professionals to develop metrics that will help guide future decisions regarding facial covering requirements. Recent trends are encouraging with a significant decline in cases. Hopefully this trend will continue and I promise to keep you posted. And finally, please join me in thanking the district's principals. October is National Principals Month, a time to recognize the essential role that principals play in making school great. I personally believe that Palm Beach County is home to the most dedicated and talented principals in the nation. They are truly the driving force of student success in our schools. I'd also like to thank our district's custodians. October 2nd is National Custodian Appreciation Day. These fine men and women are working harder than ever to keep our schools safe and clean. On behalf of the school board and the entire school district of Palm Beach County, thank you for your support of our students and staff.